In this lesson, I want to update and add in some dummy content to actually make our website more presentable and look more like a website. So let's go over first to dummy text generator or blind text generator. And this is a great way to add in some dummy text. And I'm gonna maybe do three paragraphs. I'm gonna include the paragraph tags and copy it to clipboard open up my project and then I'm going to add that in. But actually before I add that in, I'm going to update and add my H2 tags. So I want to add it after this section because this is the content that I want to stand out as H2. And then the rest are just going to be these dummy paragraph con pieces of content. And also I want to add in some content into that sidebar to actually make it look like we've got something in there. So I was thinking maybe we could add in some default add images and add those in. So let's open up our placehold text and add in some images that way. And here we've got a default size of 350 by 150. So I'm going to just take that and I'm going to drop it into my side menu. So maybe we're going to add in some paragraph and do update this to be 250 and just kind of call it ads or something like that and just do a second one. So this is going to give us the ability to have placeholders for a couple images within our website and I'm going to add in a line break in there as well just so that we're not on the same line. So now when I refresh it I've got essentially a website with some content in here. So I've got my head information, my navigation bar, which we're gonna update with CSS to actually present it as a navigation bar, and then our content area and our side menu, and then of course our footer. So the next set of lessons, we're gonna start adding in our CSS and start making this really look like the website that we're looking like, that we've originally designed within our wireframing here of our website. So this is all coming up in the next set of lessons.